Have you ever looked at a glass of water and just assumed that it was safe because it was clear? The truth is, some of the biggest dangers are completely invisible. I'm talking about a toxic substance called arsenic. And I'm here to find a better way to remove it. Hi, I'm Shabby Sala, a chemistry and material science undergraduate from Adelaide de Manila University. And I make tiny magnetic beads to help make our water safe. Arsenic is a toxic substance that can silently contaminate our groundwater through natural processes like volcanic activity. Because of this, the World Health Organization set an acceptable limit at 10 parts per billion. Imagine one single drop of ink in an entire Olympic-sized swimming pool. However, in 2019, the study of Magalona and colleagues revealed elevated levels of total arsenic content from a hot spring in Laguna. My research is about creating a better, more sustainable solution. I start with iron oxide particles, or magnetite, which is one of the most researched materials for arsenic absorption. The problem is, on their own, they clump together. Therefore, I'm developing a composite material by combining it with a stable, porous support matrix. Kaitasan, a biodegradable polymer sourced from abundant seafood shell waste. And this is done to prevent agglomeration and ensure that the iron oxide's active sites are ready to work. But creating this composite is a delicate balancing act. Too little iron oxide and you don't get enough arsenic removal. But too much on the other hand and you can compromise the bead's entire structure. The bottom line is that it has to be strong enough to hold together and effective enough to clean the water. First, I have to synthesize the core materials, further the acetylation of commercial chitosan, and co-precipitation synthesis of my iron oxide particles. Afterwards, I'll then prepare five different mass ratios of the combination of chitosan and iron oxide. Second, I'll utilize different techniques to characterize the core materials and important physical-chemical properties of the bead. And finally, I will conduct batch adsorption experiments to measure how much arsenic each formulation can remove. Safe drinking water is a fundamental human right, and my goal is to contribute to a low-cost, effective, and reusable technology. Thank you so much, Yansha, for this opportunity, and thank you all for listening. Your support helped turn the passion of young Filipina scientists into real-world solutions that our country needs.